so many different things. Oh, this is so cute. I love little diaries. This is Plaza. It's in the basement. Sometimes I like to come here first to get some snacks. They have like a lot of they have a lot of different American snacks in here and then I like to go up and walk around. All the floors shopping. These just caught my eye, these little diaries. They're so cute. I'm very busy. Cute cute. <laughs> Oh, I love stationery. Okay, done the bottom floor. Big and Viper is one of my favorite brands. It's on that floor, but I didn't find anything there today. Um, this floor, I never find anything. I'm gonna go up one more. Oh, there's Swan Kiss, one of my favorites. Oh, Emoda too. Okay, let's go in here first. I really like this brand. It's really cute. And this is probably my favorite shop in Shibuya 109. I always find stuff here. It's always cute. The trend right now, a lot of the shirts have this attached choker to them. So it's attached to the back of the shirt and it looks really cute. 2015 Taylor would go crazy right now in here. Here in Tokyo, they have a lot of the circle glasses here. Just for a thousand dollars. Just for a thousand yen, not a thousand dollars, oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Aunt Rouge, another really cute store. I really love this shop too. It's called Bubbles. Check a look in here. <laughs> oh, there's like a piercing. <laughs> I made it to the top now. On the top there's this. There's a lot of contact lenses. There's we go. There's Sanrio shop and there's spins. Alright, I'm done there. I didn't buy too much. And I didn't find anything for my Hong Kong event. I really like Zara's fashion right now. I'm gonna go in here. It's so cute. <laughs> What's your name? Yin. Yin, Yin, nice to meet you. <laughs> Shibuya I really want to go, I think. Maybe I'll just head home. I'm 
Temporary shoes are all out, and they're all huge. What I got today was first up from Emoda. I got this really pretty sweater. It's quite long and has a little bit of a turtleneck, and it's in blue checkered color. I think this would look really cute with um, like light blue ripped jeans and my circle glasses and my hair in a bun, maybe. That's what I'm thinking. I really like that. Can't wait for it to get a bit cooler to wear it. And then I went into, oh no, and then that Rav, Rav, Rasvola. I got this kind of belt. A lot of shops have these belts, these sort of, I don't know what they're called, like material belts <laughs> in right now, and I really like them. So I got that one. This side has this. What does it say? Independently styled. I don't know. I'll probably just wear it on the plain black side. And then I went into bubbles. So there's a few things I noticed a lot of. Either shirts with cutouts in them, or shirts and dresses with built-in chokers attached to like the back, or a lot of lingerie slash pajama looking stuff that you wear as clothes. These belts, um, a lot of circle glasses and sunglasses. Yeah, I'd say these things I saw a lot of in common. And I got one of those sort of lingerie looking dresses from Bubbles. Can you guys see that? So it looks like a little baby doll, black baby doll. And the bottom is like this. It's a bit lacy, but it has a black dress on the inside. And it comes with a t-shirt. And I also got this little choker from there too. It has little hearts at the bottom. And then I went to Zara, and I really wanted that short black long sleeve flower dress, but they didn't have any small sizes left. But I still found other things. I got this shirt. I thought it will look really cute with baggy mom style jeans, I think. And I thought it would look cute with this choker I got. Isn't that pretty? So I thought this with this and some distressed jeans or baggy jeans would look really cute. Um, again, in the lingerie sort of trend, I got this black top that is see Oh, it's a bodysuit. It goes with this on top. I thought this pattern was really pretty. And these colors, this orange color, would look really good with an orange lip. So it's gonna go like this. Something like that. With nice black boots, maybe a leather jacket or something for the fall. The last thing I grabbed from Zara was this. It's like a long sleeve sweater. It says C'est la vie on it. And I like these bright colors. Stripes, it's blue and then it goes black. Very cute, I thought. And that's all the clothes I got. And then I went to a bookstore and I got some magazines, which are the heaviest magazines ever. They're so big. This bag's really cute that they give you at the bookstore. It says, live every mo moment, laugh every day, love every time, and be happy. <laughs> so all the September issues of the magazines are out. And I had to grab them because September issues are always the best and biggest issues in fashion. So first of all, Vogue huge one. Kendall Jenner's on the front. I got Elle. Car on the front. And Harper's Bazaar with Kanye and Kim on the front. Kardashians are killing the September issues. I love all these people on the covers. I can't wait to read them tonight. They're all so thick. Love it. And that's everything I got today. Are you ready for bath time? Are you ready for bath time? Yes, that's a good girl. Okay. your hair. Did you have a nice bath? Did you have a nice bath? You need a treat now, don't you? Do you need treats? Did you lose it? <laughs> You're so 
I'm silly.